Wix AI website builder. How to create a website with Wix AI. Hey guys, welcome back. In this video, I'll be showing you guys how you can get started with building a Wix website using AI. So let's get into it. First off, you're just going to go into Wix and click on create new site as you normally would. Now, after that, you have a few different options. You have build on the Wix editor, start from the template. And if you go on to the Wix editor, you guys can see over here, you will be led to the Wix AI assistant. So we're going to click on start chat over here and get started with the AI chat to be able to build our website. So it's going to ask you a couple of questions and you are going to answer them according to what you want your website to look like. And then it will create a website template for you. So I want to call my website Emelyn Designs like this. And the second question is, okay, we're having some issues with the chat to continue to setting up your site. We are going to, can you rephrase this for me? Now we are going to be led to the basic question and answer section. So I want this to be an online clothes store. And then I'll click on next over here. After that, this will prepare our dashboard for us. And then once our dashboard has been prepared on Wix, we can continue with the Wix Studio Editor to start building with AI. Now this is just going to be a basic structure and I'm just going to click on edit site in my dashboard. Now this is going to be our dashboard, but we're going to be focusing on setting up our store. So we will click on design site on the top right and then I'm going to click on start now. And I want to let Wix build a website for me. So this will open up the Wix website editor and from here we're going to generate our site. Now you guys can see we're generating my site, your online clothing store. Once the site is ready, you can click on anything you want. So based on your site profile, its content will be generated based on your description. Your site theme will be a gentle floral designs with shades of green and yellow. Its layout will include arches and round floating shapes. So let's wait for the AI to complete the website generation for us. Now you guys can see this is the template that Wix has generated. Now let's say I want to make this a little different. So I can click on make it a little different and then it can choose to redesign the website according to the information that you have previously provided Wix with. So now it has used shades of green and yellow. It has changed the layout a little. And then once we have completed this, we can also choose to regenerate this the site as well. But let's say I have the site profile and I can click on this and call it Emelyn Designs. And then after that, we have a site description. So this is a luxury, elegant, high fashion clothing store that we are looking to create. And then we have our contact info and I can add a social link and this might be tiktok.com slash Emelyn. And then I'm going to click on apply changes over here. Now after this, this will update our site profile and our site will be generated accordingly. Your site profile, structure, description, theme, and layout all are integral components that can be altered to make the AI-based template different for you. So we're going to wait and this is now our new design, Emily Designs Quality Style Perfection. And I can click on the site structure and I can choose the things I want to include. But right now I'm pretty satisfied with the appearance of our site. So I will click on continue to the site on the top right. And then from here, I'm going to click on continue to editor. And now we can take this AI based design and customize it to make it more personalized to our specific store. So once we have opened up the Wix website editor, we can get started with editing accordingly because obviously no matter how great the ai based builder is there might be certain things you might want to tweak by yourself certain style preferences you might have like having a contact us section that has a lined outline i just don't like that so we can customize that as well but first off i'm going to go into this line and i want to move this up so it doesn't look conjoined with our contact button or I want to include the contact us button in the top section instead. And I'm just going to reduce the size on this and then just move it over here. Now, once we've done that, we can click on quick edit to do a quick edit from the right. And then from the top left, you have options to edit with elements as well as sections or pages. Then you also have options to customize the overall site design. 
though, because this is an entire site, having individual changes, if you are looking to, you know, change a lot of stuff, can take a lot of time. So you can go ahead and go into your site design over here and then click on change theme. And let's say I want to go with a different color theme. So I want to go with warm like this or tangy or placid like this. So you can choose, you know, whichever theme that you personally prefer. I want to go with the energetic one because I really like pink and it has a lot of pinks, but this is just personal preferences. You can also customize your site design by choosing colors by yourself. So if I want, I can choose, you know, my own colors like this. Let's say I want this to be in a black, gray, and one accent pink, and then the rest is going to be more gray like this so like this we can also customize our site over here and then below that you even have some other settings which includes your text themes so let's say i want all of my text to be the sarah bun filter and then after that i will go back and then i can go into the page backgrounds i can insert a specific type of background color that i might want to prefer throughout the website now, taking this basic AI based designs, I want to insert my own image over here. So I'm going to click on change background and I might want to insert a background like this over here. But I'm going to click on this section, which is our second column, and I'm going to change the background on this. Click on image and I can upload my own images over here from my own store or my own files. So I'm going to go into my site files and I'll just click on upload media or upload from our computer and I'm going to upload the original product images I might have. So I'll just open these up and then I'll insert these into the AI based design. Now I'm going to click on change background and I've taken this image. Now we have two columns here. We have this video inserted over here as well, but I want to remove this section. So I'll just click on delete and I'm going to delete the strip column at the bottom as well because there is no need for such a large break. And then I will move this section up and then we have our product section. Then we have this limited time offer section, which I'm going to click and then delete because it isn't relevant. Then we have our story where we can go on ahead and customize the text as well as a community and some other sections. Now to create our second page, we can click on pages and menu on the left, and then we have our store pages and then our basic home page. And I can click on add menu item, new page, and I can choose a blank page or a pre-existing template to get started from. So I'll take a blank page from here, going to pages over here, and once I go into pages, we will click on the page info and we will click on rename. And let's say I want this to be a runway. This page is going to be called runway and I'll just click on done over here. Once I do that, I can go into sections and choose to insert certain sections that might be representative of our particular Wix page. So in this way, you can build your own customized site with Wix AI. And once you have finished customizing, you can click on publish on the top right to be able to publish your AI based design. Now, if I click on view site over here in under 10 minutes, I have created this gorgeous looking Wix store and I can just insert my product and then our business would be ready to go. So I hope you guys found this video helpful. If you did, make sure to leave a like and subscribe to our YouTube channel. And if you have any questions or queries, leave those in the comment box down below. I would love to know what you guys have to say.